guys, Katrina here, the Zapper Weavy. Welcome back to my channel. Well, if you've seen my post on my Facebook page last night, you will know what I'm going to do for the next couple of weeks. I'm going to uh, start making some uh, painted rocks for the Facebook page uh, EDS Zapper Rocks. I will uh, include a link to their Facebook page and their Instagram page in the, in the description. Uh, if you remember, ages ago, I left one of their rocks that somebody else made at the, the place where the Titanic was built ages ago. So I'm going to start making some. And once I start my disability access review tours, again, I will leave a rock wherever I do the tour. And I will also post a photo of it on my Instagram account. I think these should do. Not bad for the price. I got these paints and this little paint pen here. This is to do the writing with. I can't find a white one, but now just to get brushes. That should do it. And I got this top of varnish, although I think I've lifted the wrong one, but I'll go and see if there's any different ones. Okay, so I actually did lift the wrong one, but this is the right one now. This is just to protect it. Alright, so let's get home and get all this unpacked and get started. Right, well these look manky, so I'm gonna open them up and get them a wash with the hose out in the garden. They're a good big size anyway. Maybe those ones are a few but too big like, but the bigger the better. And that one kind of looks like a potato. Right, I shall leave these over the night to dry. It's not to rain tonight, so I'll get these painted in the morning. Well, it's now Monday morning, so these are dry. So I took them in just to paint them later on. All right, so I'm only gonna do these two big ones here. Basically, uh, this is gonna take a while to do, so I'm not gonna show you ma me making them all. But I was thinking maybe for these two, red and blue and once the colours dry in I'm going to use the varnish to uh, sort of harden it and then do the writing once the varnish is dried. Right let's do the blue one first and sorry I have no microphone plugged in because the lead's not long enough. I'm sure this brush is too big but sooner it gets done the better. I'm just going to cover the whole thing in paint. This is where I put newspaper down, isn't it? Now for the red one. These are just cheap paints I bought out of the range. So I might have to put another coat on it.
All right, so that's them both covered. We'll leave them for a few hours to dry and then we'll come back and do the varnish coat. Okay, so it's now Tuesday and I left these overnight to dry and they're varnished and all, but I did make a mistake. As you can see, the newspaper that I was using last night to uh, line my desk uh, got stuck to it. Oh, well, I know not to do that again. So this time I've changed it to an old bin liner. But I did buy some uh, gold Sharpie pens uh, because the shop that I went to to get the paints didn't have uh, any in these colour. So I'm going to decorate them now. I'm not very good at drawing. I'm going to try and make this one a golden zebra. Yeah, art was not one of my strong points in school, so it's going to be what it's going to be. I told you it wasn't very good at heart, but uh, at least I tried. And on the back of the rocks, there's text. It says uh, hashtag EDS Zebra Rocks. Please post a photo on our Facebook page and rehide. Also, you will notice I am wearing my new uh, Just Strong top. Just Strong is an online only brand that I found. It is a bit pricey now but it is good, really good quality and I generally find active wear more comfortable and more easy to wear and easy to get on and off with my disability. So if you would like to check them out please click on the link in the description and then you'll also get a discount as well for doing that. So that's me finished making my first two rocks. I have made a start on making another two. I'm not going to show you me making them all because to do this video literally took four days so I will get a bit bored. I hope you enjoyed this. I am going to start doing my review tours again because the lockdown restrictions weren't as severe as I thought that they were going to be. Uh, Boris Johnson was on the TV last night and he said that uh, public places will still be open, so I'm going to get back to doing that unless they tell me to go into isolation. So stay tuned if you want more content like that. Uh, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. I enjoyed making it. If you did enjoy it, please uh, give me a like, comment and subscribe by clicking below. And remember to hit the notification bell. As YouTube does not notify you when I upload a video unless you hit the notification bell. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.